This is a qualitative recreation of an experiment that Michael Faraday did in the early 19th century. He had two coils of wire. This coil here is connected up to a battery, and so it produces a magnetic field. This coil here is connected to a galvanometer. What Faraday expected to see, like we think, was that when he hooked this up to produce a current in the first coil, he would produce a current in the second coil. But actually, you can look and you can see there's no current. However, what Faraday then discovered was that when he connected or disconnected the circuit, there would be a current. So here we've got a current in that first coil, produces a magnetic field. When I cut the current in the first coil, you'll notice that the galvanometer deflects just for a fraction of a second. And when I connect it back up, I get a deflection in the opposite direction. What Faraday realized was that it's not the magnetic field, but it's the change in magnetic field that's important in producing the current. This is the fundamental experiment in electromagnetic induction, and we'll see several more experiments that show related effects.